tail of the tape. Here we go, first one, you ready? You ready? Let's and with that, we are underway here at the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. Well, he was perfect as a heavyweight since dropping to the light heavyweight division. He has been equally dominant. We'll see how the two-time U.S. Olympian Daniel Cormier approaches this opponent tonight. Gotta figure you'll see heavy doses of takedowns in the early going tonight. Oh, big kick! And now starting to snap off that jab. Really missed with that right hand. Jones gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Nice left hand. And there's that inside leg kick. Oh, huge block. That one hurt. Well, he left his body wide open there for that hook shot, Joe, and he paid for it. He is leaning in. I know he's got the guard high, but that means the body is exposed and the opposition took full advantage there. Kick lands for him. These guys are swinging. Under three minutes now to go in round one. There's a nice left by John. Back to the overhand. Oh, beautiful kick there. in half guard. Cormier gets caught with that punch. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Wow, what a powerful leg kick that was. Nice punch there by Jones. Hit, Hit him hard with that hook. The left hook hits home. Oh, now he's got the tight clinch, Joe. That knee might have landed there. Oh, misses with the jab. Pretty nice leg kick there, Joe. Good work on the feet by Jones. Huge block there. There he goes. There's a left. Yeah, and here he goes again. Cormier gets back up again. Lands an outside leg kick of his own. Cormier gets caught with that punch. Oh, he lands a elbow. huge elbow to the head. Oh! What a leg kick! And he lands that leg kick again. Rocked him with that right hand. It looks like he's limping. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. Here's a look at some of the action here. Here's a big leg kick. Excellent strike here, lands on target. And here we see a devastating suplex. Brittany Palmer with us tonight. Here we go, second round, you ready? All right, let's get to round two. All right, so here we go with round two. We'll see if these fighters get after it. You saw at the beginning of round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Entertaining round, don't get me wrong, but we will see here in round two if there's an uptick in the aggression on both sides. John Jones has fantastic wrestling, fantastic use of space and distance. He's one of the best fighters at utilizing his reach, and he also has wild, unpredictable, creative striking skills. Oh, he left his head wide open to absorb that straight hand. He has shown a vulnerability here by leaning in right into his opponent's range. Cormier gets caught with that punch. He's got to figure out a way to get that guard higher, Joe. And speed, man. Beautifully placed in time kick there by Cormier. Just out of range with that right hand. Good kick to the body by DC. How does he even put any weight on that leg? Look at the bruise on the outside of his thigh. And he connects there. John looking for the takedown. Oh, wow. Nice Slams him right to the canvas, Joe. 
in half guard now. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Nice. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now. Oh, Looks a little wobbly on his feet. He's got to be careful oh. here. Big body shot, shot body. Woo! Woo! Look at that jab. Cormier's leg appears to be hurt here, Joe. That is an obvious leg. Another takedown attempt here. Okay, now he's got him up against the cage. And there comes the separation now. He's down! He postures into place. Cormier gets up, but he looks dazed. He looks confused. Nice. One-two punch by Cormier. Well, Joey he seems to have his opponent's timing down. He has landed some good shots, but nothing really in terms of multi-shot combinations, and perhaps that's why his opponent's still standing. So perhaps at this point, he could change up the power with which he throws some of these strikes, maybe alter the tempo a little bit, and try to make a oh, nice slam as he gets him to the canvas. Exactly what he needed. He's got the clinch. He's back to his feet, but he's hurt. Knees right here. He's got to get those knees to the body. He lands one. And again, keeping that knee on the midsection. Two rounds in the books. All right, so the round is over. There is the horn, but not before he got a huge knockdown. A great round from John Jones. Yeah, that knockdown should have won him the round. It was a big moment in the fight. There it is again. When you move forward, you have this guy's number. Give me some forward motion and add some takedowns. Thank you very much, Ariane Celeste. Now, starting off this round, he might still be hurt. He's going to want to look to be defensive and move and avoid getting hit and try to recover. Oh, he hurt him. This could be it. And there he swung with a haymaker. Oh, big left. Looks like his leg is hurt here, Joe. You can see him limping a little bit. Well, most fighters can't this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Gets up again here, but hurting. Oh, That's a big right 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 hand by Cormier. Cormier gets in the clinch. Constantly a moving target. Just over three minutes to go. Neither fighter's really doing anything. And he's in north-south position. Hits the reversal and right into north-south. And there's one leg over. He's almost mounted him here. He's got it. He's mounted him. He hip escapes from the full mount. Good control. Postures up. In half guard position. Ooh. Vicious elbow lands to the head. Oh, and he gives up his back. And he's flattened him out. Jones's lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that area now. Back to the mount again. Splits the guard, connects with the punch there, Joe. Got his back again. He's got him flattened out. He's got him flattened out here. Half guard here. He's back to full mount again. Big oh, elbow there, man. Nice. That is rough. Moves to half guard. Back to the feet. 
Watch his butt. John Jones attacking the body. I would agree with you there, Joe. These body strikes are really going to start to take their toll. Mixing it up beautifully. Hook shots to the body, the weapon now. Oh, excellent exchange there. Ten seconds. Oh, big elbow. What a round. Oh, 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 oh. oh, what a way to end the round. Saved by the bell. He got stunned by a huge shot right before the horn. And now, a little bit gingerly, he makes his way back to the stool. And he's only got 60 seconds to recover here. So we'll see if his corner, physically, mentally, can keep this fighter in the fight. Here's a devastating kick that results in a knockdown. Oh, hey, give me some more here. That is a bad cut, and I need you to stop protecting. All right, here's round four, fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. Try to establish that jab. Cormier's leg is hurt here, Joe. You can see him starting to limp a little bit. Now he's got the Muay Thai plum. Nice knee to the body there by Jones. Oh, defense into offense there as he blocks the strike and counters with a perfect jab. Wow! Daniel's hurt. Oh! Beautiful Big body, body shot. shot there, too. He's teeing off with some vicious shots. Well, I know he's trying to set up his own offense, but again, he leans right into the uppercut, and that one appeared to land pretty flush, Joe. Let's see if he can circle out and prevent any further damage here in this round. Just out of range with the straight left hand. Oh, spinning back fist. He solved it right there. Very nice. Well-placed kick there, Joe. Oh, now he has found his timing. He is doling out punishment here. Leg kick checked effectively there by Jones. How about that shin? Oh, how about the slam there? That one cannot feel good. And he gets reversed. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by Jones. Look at this. He's out of it. Oh, pretty good work here from the bottom, Joe, as he tags him with that punch. Now he's in half guard. Two minutes now to go in the round. Full guard here. It looks like he's trying to isolate that arm here. He's got his wrist clasped together, the double wrist lock position. Excellent posture here. Busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Moves in a full mount. Awesome control from the top. Oh, and he connects there. Daniel's got some posture here. He's up. He's got some space. And now he moves to his back. Mounts again. It appears that cut is getting worse. He survived, got back to his feet. Well, looks as though his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Horn sounds when he ends the round four. So the round is over mercifully for his opponent. Multiple knockdowns there. Big, big round from John Jones. I have no idea how his opponent got out of that round. He was knocked down multiple occasions in big trouble, but his heart pulled him through. Here's a nasty head kick that lands. Here we see a devastating punch that results in a knockdown. Ariane Celeste on hand. Here we go, final round, you ready? You ready? 
So here it is, folks, fifth and final round. Nasty oh, leg kick. He's not going to be able to continue. That's it. It's over. Got the stoppage from a nasty leg kick. Well, it's not every day in the UFC that you see a fight ended due to a leg kick, but that one was absolutely devastating. He took away that lead leg of his opponent, who became a one-legged fighter, and then it became just a matter of time. So somewhat anticlimactic here tonight, but not for the winner, as he gets one of the bigger TKO wins of his UFC career. Let's take a look at it from a different angle. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the win by TKO. That is one they'll be talking about for quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki has called a stop to this contest at four seconds of round number five. To bring the winner by TKO, John Jones! So another big win for Johnny Bones Jones here tonight. He has every tool you could possibly want as a mixed martial artist, and he put most of them to very good use here tonight. Some people were picking against him. They felt like this matchup maybe wouldn't work for John Jones. John Jones proved yet again that if he is not the greatest mixed martial arts athlete we have ever seen, he is certainly in the conversation.